Good morning, dear traders. You are watching Economic News on InstaForex TV channel with me, Tahmin Salomova. The US dollar paid losses against a basket of major currencies after the labor market printed better than expected statistics. Investors showed positive sentiment even despite weak new home sales data. Besides, the US dollar was still trading under pressure while the market was expecting the UK's EU referendum results to be declared. By the end of deals, the US dollar index was at 93.42. Currency strategists doubt that the US dollar index would close the week with the search taking into account that the EU referendum results had not been announced. Traders proceeded cautiously in buying the US national currency after initial jobless claims were released in the New York session. The number of unemployment filling for state benefits fell to lowest level since April. A few days ago, the Federal Reserve Chairwoman Janet Yellen said in a speech that the US labor market appeared to have slowed more recently. Meanwhile, initial claims for unemployment benefits published yesterday showed just the opposite. According to an official report from the US Labor Department, initial jobless claims dropped by 18,000 to seasonally adjusted 259,000 for the week and June 18. The data encouraged investors' optimism as it came in lower than figures for the previous week. The unemployment rate in the United States came at 4.6 percent. The U.S. Commerce Department reported that new home sales fell by 6 percent to a seasonally adjusted annual rate of 551,000 units. Analysts had expected a bigger decline. The U.S. dollar was trading higher in early New York deals as soon as the U.S. macroeconomic reports were published. You will find out about the results of the referendum on Britain's membership of uh, the European Union from our next new releases on the InstaForex TV channel.